On the way to record the game. Oh, I forgot the quick release. Wait, the VO3? It's got new lenses, mic covers, new cooling system, different plate, SIM cards on the back, easy grip top. Let's go test it out. So here we have the two and the three up on the same tripod. So, so we'll compare the VO2 and the VO3. The VO3 camera just came out and we used it at a showcase over the weekend. I start off by talking about teams that don't have a camera or have the VO1, and then looking at the VO3 and who it might be a good fit for. We move down to if you already have a VO2, and we look at the VO3, and how it compares some of the similarities that you might see. We talk about how the SIM card is different with the VO3, and then we move into the VO camera feature. So we started off with live streaming because we live streamed all the games from the showcase. So I went into the functionality and feature of the live stream, some of the new things that you can do with it. Then we moved on to the audio. One of the days, two of the days were really windy. So we, uh, we were able to test out the improvements in the audio. Then we go down to the video. We look at the difference in the left and the right lens. And so um, recording into the sun and motion and wind and comparisons here. We were recording with the VO2 and the VO3, the same game. So we did some comparisons between both, both of those cameras. We looked at the zoom level. We looked at the lenses themselves. We also looked at some, um, like some of the directed highlight between the three and the two. And then we looked at um, the HDR and the, at night. We talked a little bit about some of the changes in connectivity and how you could do instant replay from farther away on the field and the startup and the shutdown time. Then the cooling system, we didn't really get to test this out much because it's um, not hot out, but we take a look at how it's set up and talked about that. There's the player spotlight. So the VO player tracking was announced, um, but it's not out yet. So we talk a little bit about that and how what it might do. We talked about upgrading people who have a VO1 or a 2. Um, if you want to sell your camera and get a VO3, on our site, you can lift your camera and other teams can find it to buy it. So we talk about that. Talk a little bit about who might want to upgrade and how you can get a discount on the VO Camera 3. So if you have questions that we didn't cover here or th more things that we could talk about, please let me know. I will put a link to this review below the video. For more information on recording your games, check us out on easysportsvideo.com slash start. Thanks.